to hear something crazy? I added more power to my Tesla Model 3 George Jetson from a toilet seat in Tokyo, Japan. Okay, that was actually from the driver's seat. now but a couple of days ago I was in Tokyo Japan on a trip with my airline now when I arrived there it was right around dinner time so I walked around a bit then found a great restaurant that served ramen with dumplings then headed back to the hotel for a well-deserved good night's sleep when I awoke the next morning I brought my iPhone with me to the bathroom eh, yeah it's kind of what I do but I get to check emails and such while I'm away and anyway that's when an alert popped up on my phone to notify me that I had a new Tesla software update available. And with all the rumors I heard about this update, I was pretty anxious to install it. So I did it right there on the spot. Oh, or would that be the pot? But it wasn't until I actually flew the 10 hours back to Los Angeles and then a 45 minute flight home that I actually got to see everything that was in this update. Now, besides any more power, okay, I got it. <laughs> Holy sh! This update also added driving visualization improvements. One such improvement is that the cameras now recognize traffic cones, like we're seeing here. Another is stopping mode, which basically brings one pedal driving to the Model 3. To demonstrate this, there's an automatic gate in my subdivision that I always needed to hit the brakes for, as the regen braking would cut out right around 5 miles per hour and the car would just basically roll forward. Now with stopping mode, I no longer have to use the brake pedal as the car will slow down all the way to 0 miles per hour and then go into hold mode, which gives the gate plenty of time to open. This update also brings scheduled departure to the Model 3, which schedules your car to a specific charge as well as to warm or cool the cabin at a time you might ordinarily leave for work, let's say. This update really doesn't do anything for me as my schedule is different almost every day of the week. Last but not least, there was power increase. Oh my god! Oh my god! The update says there's approximately a 5% increase in acceleration and performance. Now, I didn't run any specific acceleration test, but I can report that my Model 3 does feel a lot peppier with a smidge less battery drain. Of course, time will tell if this is really the case. Either way, I'm amazed that this is something that could have been done via a software update, whether I was sitting on a Japanese toilet or not. Anyway, I hope this video was not only enjoyable, but helpful. And if that's the case, smash that like button like a Model 3 accelerator pedal. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> and also consider subscribing if you haven't done so already and click that notification bell so you're informed of every new video that I do post and also don't forget about the 1000 free supercharger models that we can both get if you purchase a model 3 by using the link down below in the description and as always thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video